Hey, what's up, you everybody? AJ here. Okay, this is a prepper meal for muscle gains and maintenance. Uh, this can be utilized e even during a SHTF situation because you should all have this in your prepper pantry. We should have rice, beans, broccoli stalks, chia seeds, and marijuana seeds. We should either have the broccoli stalks out of our garden or we should have them put up. The chia seeds, marijuana seeds, rice, and beans, we all should have put up either way. And this particular one is uh, pinto beans is what I'm using. So anyways, uh, separately, uh, rice and beans are an incomplete protein. Uh, however, together, they make a very complete protein, which are full of essential uh, amino acids and plus some other good stuff for you. But essentially, it's a complete protein, which uh, a complete protein is the best, by far the best protein you can get. Now, so with white rice, um, it's full of carbohydrates, and so you want to mix it properly into your diet, um, because that's what we're all stacking back is uh, white, white, right? White rice, and so um, you just got to be careful with that. But with that being said, there is uh, some new scientific proof that um, cooking starchy foods, whether it be rice. Uh, spaghetti noodles, anything like that, uh, even potatoes that are starchy foods. Um, you cook them, you let them cool down, and then you reheat them, and you're taking a lot of that starch out of there, and you're making it a lot more of a fibrous uh, food, and so it's a lot healthier, and it's been proven to, you know, not uh, lead into early onset of diabetes and stuff like that when you eat, you know, too many starches and everything like that, or carbohydrates, starches, either one, I guess they're basically the same thing. Um, but anyways, uh, Doing that, it, like I said, it, it just reduces the amount of uh, carbohydrates and converts it more into a fiber. So do your own research on that. You know, I'm just a silly YouTuber. Obviously, I can't even use the phone right. I keep looking at my hand instead of the camera. So don't take my advice. I'm just, this is what I do. Um, these items and this recipe, you know, we should have all this stored back for a rainy day. I mean, you know, uh, we're all preppers. So we have these items or we should have these items. So with these items for this recipe, you know, it's, this meal is going to give you 450 calories, 50 grams of protein, 30 grams of fiber, and 90 grams of carbohydrates, plus a ton of other nutritional things, vitamins, minerals, all kinds of goodies in there. And that comes from the marijuana seeds and the chia seeds and the broccoli, of course. Um, so I try not to personally consume more than 100 grams of carbs per day on a heavy calorie week. That's the same with my protein. I try to keep it 190 grams. But even on my light calorie week, uh, I want 190 grams of protein. So my carbs will go down some, but my proteins, they're going to stay right around that 190 range. Um, now, I'll have the amounts in the description was my plan. Hopefully I remember to do that, but I'll rattle them off real quick. So you got a quarter cup of rice and pinto beans, and then you got one ounce of chia seeds. You got three tablespoons. I'd use just level tablespoons of uh, marijuana seeds. And you mix that all up, cook it together, and then I don't even cook the chia seeds and the marijuana seeds, actually. I cook everything else, then I let it cool, I reheat it, and then I add my chia seeds and my marijuana seeds to it. And that's how you will build a really good, you know, one-time meal for, you know, gaining muscle and or maintenance on your muscle for, uh, during an SHTF situation. So you can still over there for whatever reason, it's the red dot. Sorry guys, uh, during a SHTF situation or something like that, grid down, whatever, you know, you have these foods so you can still stay healthy and in good shape doing it, you know. Exercise and eating right now and exercising and eating right during these events will help you out drastically. So, you know, I'll try to put out a few more recipes if anybody's interested. Um, it's hard to tell anymore, and it's hard to tell if I'm gonna actually stay on this type of a, a subject. You know, I bounce all over the place, and I apologize about that. It's ADD, ADH, I don't know what it is. I just, I'm like a squirrel, start running around. So, anyways, before I ramble on anymore, I'm gonna get off of here. Y'all stay safe, have a good night, later.